Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm back, you're back, we're all back, winter's back. So today I am going to show you how to make flan or you can call it egg pudding. The flan is super delicious desert. In this, a creamy and caramel taste and it's textured absolutely looks not watery. So let's start making a delicious flan or egg pudding. So we're gonna be making flan and to make flan we need one third cup of water and six tablespoons of sugar. We're gonna caramelize the water and the sugar so that the flan can taste good. So my stove is on medium heat and so into this I'm going to add six tablespoons of sugar. First you want to add the sugar because that's how it is. One third cup of water. And now we're gonna be cooking it until it changes the color like a little bit brown color. And you want to stir it like this. And once you stirred it, now put on medium low heat. So now our plan is done. And this is the color that we want. Right here I have a uh, oven safe bowl. Into this I'm gonna pour this uh, syrup. And now what you want to do is to even it out. How beautiful the color is. Now I'm going to put this aside and start making it pudding. So in order to make a flan you would need a flan pudding and for making a flan pudding you need a blender. So in the blender I'm going to add two cups of milk and the next ingredient is half cup of sugar, four eggs, One teaspoon of vanilla extract and lastly a pinch of salt and now you want to cover the blender plug it in turn it on on the highest one so now I'm going to use a sifter to pour my pudding into the sifter so that I can keep all the bubbles out and if you don't use sifter, it's gonna mess up the pudding. Now I sifted it out and all the foams are now out. So this is an oven safe baking dish if, in case you didn't hear it before. So now what you want to do is take the pan, put this baking dish into this pan and pour hot water around it. So if you pour hot water, it will bake evenly. And you'll be pouring the water halfway through. Make this at 320 Fahrenheit for 40 to 45 minutes. I took it out from the oven. I wait until it cools down. I remove the hot water pan, and now I'm gonna wrap it around this plastic wrap, cover it, and this is really sticky. Now I'm gonna cool it down at room temperature, and then I'll refrigerate it for four hours. Now it has been four hours for being refrigerated and I took it out from the refrigerator and now I'm going to move this wrap look at this so now what I'm going to do 
and I'm gonna cut it from the edges. Just like this. Now I have cut it from the edges. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get a plate and put it over this. Then what you wanna do is flip it. Now I flipped it. Now what you wanna do is give it a few taps. I gave it a few taps. Now let's see what is the result inside. Look at this. Look at the colors and the texture of this. Colors. It looks really nice. Now it's time for the taste test. It tastes so good. You can taste the sugar and the caramel as well as the creamy flavors and like the vanilla extract. It almost tastes like coffee. So try this at home. This recipe is so easy to make. If you like this video, please like, comment, share, and don't forget to subscribe. Bye! Bye.